Hey there people, it's Sunfruit Fruit Danny. So I wanted to talk about a very important topic that I've been aware of for a very long time. This is something I discovered intuitively a very long time ago. And that is that our thoughts literally create our reality. And this is literally known as the law of attraction. So literally your internal self is reflected in the external world. So for example, if you have a poverty mindset, then you will see poverty everywhere and you will most likely see that from your own perspective even though it's not necessarily true that all rich people are bad so basically you really need to be a conscious creator of what you want rather than what you don't want because what you focus upon will become a reality whether you desire it or not so be very very conscious and careful of what you think about what you speak about what you also listen to as well and you cannot escape this universal law whatsoever so really focus upon the things that you want so for example if you want to be rich and wealthy in life work towards things that can make you become rich and wealthy so pursuing a career that you want and learning the skills that you need to become very successful in that career and earn as much money as you possibly can also, try and surround yourself with people that are successful, but if you're not surrounded by people that are like that, then make sure you avoid people that are not, and just listen to like audio books from successful entrepreneurs and videos on YouTube and their books and learn from them, and it will begin to program your subconscious mind with those things that you are learning, basically, from those resources. And then, just also on a regular basis, every single day as much as you can, do visualization, close your eyes, and just visualize a magnet on you, like here, and see loads of money just being attracted to you, literally like you are a money magnet. And other ones that are really effective as well is witnessing the amount of money in your bank that you want to have in your bank. And also you could witness it in your PayPal account as well and you could visualize you having loads of money at home and in your wallet or your purse. And when you are doing these visualizations, really feel the emotional charge towards them. Just be saying things like gratitude, saying I'm so grateful for this money, I'm so grateful to be abundant and wealthy and just feel all of that appreciation towards it because if you're not feeling the emotion towards it and you're not saying things like this it's not going to work to the full extent so you really need to be doing that and also visualize what you are going to spend it on because basically the way the law of attraction works if it sees that you just want loads of money and you want to hoard it you don't really want anything it's going to be a lot harder to attract it but if it's seeing you want to spend it on things then it's like okay that person needs or wants those things and we are going to send them in the right direction to start earning more money so they can afford to buy that thing in this physical reality so yeah they're just a few different visualizations there are loads of different ones you can do as well you can search up loads of them on youtube and from other resources as well but i highly recommend you give them a go when i do this i just start to feel so grateful so appreciative my mood goes up and I just go into such a deep sense of gratitude and appreciation that just makes me feel so alive and abundant and wealthy and rich as if it existed now. So then I start to send that out to the universe and it starts to be pulled towards me. And what this is doing for your conscious and subconscious mind, it doesn't know the difference between like imagination with visualization and the physical reality. So, so it believes it's in the physical reality and then it will start to appear in your reality. It may not happen overnight, but start doing this on a regular basis and work towards the things to achieve those things and it will become a reality and I've done this with so many things in life and you can be very specific for example I had a friend before she wanted a specific red bike for a specific price and all these other specifications and then boom it appeared in a bike shop not long after and she set a set time as well for it so yeah that's just one good example from a friend of mine and I've done it with loads of things as well. So from my own experience and other people I've spoken to, it works very, very well, this law of attraction. And also I would advise listening to videos from people that have gone from poverty to literally riches. So for example, Chris Gardner, he was homeless, now he is a millionaire. So yeah, there's a lot of different stories out there. So listen to these inspirational stories because then it will start to get you to believe that if they can do it, you can do it too. So again, consciously and subconsciously, your body starts to believe that you can and it will help you go in that direction. And yeah, whatever it is you're going for that you want to attract as well, whether it's money, health, whatever you desire, I would not recommend telling other people about this, especially 
your family members and close friends unless they're very open-minded and they understand the law of attraction because they will basically the majority of them not believe in you and they can think you're crazy and they can say things that really make you not believe in yourself and make you fearful so yeah be very careful about who you talk about with your dreams and desires that you want to attract into your life because it could just make it a lot harder to achieve those things. And yeah, do not let anyone else's opinion of you become your reality. Because a lot of people out there, they will, for example, they won't believe in you and a lot of people then don't believe in themselves. So then that person's belief of not believing in you becomes your reality and it's not necessarily truth and it's not your own. So if that does happen to you, just tune out of them and just ignore them because yeah, they're not beneficial to you and they're not true at all. And last but not least, I highly recommend the attitude of gratitude every single day. You could do this for a few minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes. You could just do it at random times throughout the day. It doesn't matter. But literally sit there with your eyes closed. It could be open as well and just be present within the moment and just for example i'll do it now i am grateful to be alive and really feel the emotion when you're saying that thing and what emotion it's bringing up within you so for me when i say it then it makes you feel really happy and grateful and just amazing all around and then i could be like i am grateful to be me i am grateful to be so rich i'm grateful to be alive and to be part of this human existence and so on and so on and so on and again the universe is seeing that you're very very grateful and it just wants to give you more abundance and wealth and prosperity in every area of your life and it will give you more of the things that you're grateful for so if you're saying you're grateful for money it will work with attracting a lot more money into your life and any other things that you focus upon and then what i recommend is for about three minutes, one to three minutes afterwards, just go, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And you watch, your mood is gonna go through the roof. You're gonna feel absolutely abundant and just so amazing. You can literally feel depressed, anxious, worried, fearful. Do this and you will just, yeah, go from feeling not so great to feeling so alive and happy. And who doesn't want that? So yeah, that's just a few different things that I wanted to make people aware of and teach people on this because a lot of people are not. And yeah, a lot of people are unconsciously creating a life that they do not desire. A life that I would basically call a life unlived. So yeah, I wanna help people create the life of their dreams so they can live the most happy, fulfilling life that they have ever lived and live up to their full potential and become the most true, authentic version of their self. So yeah, if you have any questions on this subject, please leave them down below. I love answering your questions. And if you like the video, like it down below, share it with others that you think might find this helpful because yeah, it may benefit someone greatly because yeah, a lot of people aren't aware of this and a lot of people need to be aware of this. And if you haven't subscribed already, hit the subscribe button down below to receive more videos on a regular basis where I'm talking about topics like this, how to create the life of your dreams, how to achieve the highest level of health, get the fitness levels that you desire and so many more things that I've managed to achieve in my life to just get to the point of living the best life that I have ever had and that I could have never even have thought was possible and helping others do the same. So yeah, thanks for watching. Have a happy, healthy day. Bye.